now once again this uh, question is directly formula based i will be using the expression fractional change in uh, density that is coefficient of volume expansion gamma multiplied by change in temperature gamma delta t simply this question says that coefficient of volume expansion of of glycerin is 5 into 10 to the power minus 4 per kelvin so this expression is 5 into 10 power minus 4 and you have to uh, make a raise in temperature as 40 degree celsius so these two values are simply to be multiplied and you will be getting the required answer the correct answer will be simply 0 0.02 this is the answer to question 178 switch over to next question that is 179 This uh, question 179 is based on direct formula of photoelectric effect. You can have uh, two situations here. The formula I will be using is SC by lambda. This is equal to work function plus kinetic energy maximum. So it is saying that it has been illuminated by wavelength lambda and lambda by 2. So in two cases you have. The moment you will be reducing the wavelength the kinetic energy will become more they are saying in the second case the kinetic energy is three times three times the first case so you have to calculate what is the work function this is what is required in the question if you solve this thing you simply multiplied by three these are the two equations you got multiplied by three and subtract it then you will be getting phi as hc by two lambda this is the answer you will be having so second option will be the correct option for question 179 now let us uh, get down to the last question that is question 180. In this question you can see that you have right angled prism and on which three colors are coming. All these colors when they will be coming the angle of incidence you can see this will be 45 degree. Now they have been given that what is the value of refractive index for these three colors and you have to choose from following options. You see for uh, angle of incidence 45 degree had this been the critical angle the value of mu will be equal to 1.414. So now the colors which have refractive index more than this they will be undergoing total internal reflection but the color which does not have the refractive index so much that is red color so it will not be undergoing any total internal reflection so it will be simply passing on and rest of the two colors will be undergoing total internal reflection. So that way the red color will be separated from blue and green color. I will be marking option 1 for this particular question that is question 180. Now that brings to the end of the discussion of physics part code A. Thank you.